incredible first lady. And I'll never forget uh, when we were first dating, and I asked her, tell me your favorite role model of a couple who demonstrates a loving relationship. And she actually said Ronald and Nancy Reagan. And in so many ways, Meta actually reminds me of Nancy Reagan. She's beautiful, she's elegant, extremely smart. Um, she is a stand by your man, woman, uh, incredibly protective of me, no details too small, tells me how to dress, <laughs> <laughs> along with uh, Hector, advised me on the big decisions. She's an incredible mother. Basically, she runs the show. And, and I can't thank you enough for that. You are the love of my life. You, you got, a lot of you guys know this. So when I first came on the trustees, Meta was so excited that she wanted to move here and buy a farm with a barn. And she lit up all the real estate agents. Like, oh, no, 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 no. I'm an engineer. No, 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 no. So anyway. Love you. Yeah, it, uh, the other person I deeply like to thank is uh, Hector, not only for all the work uh, he does at the foundation, but he is just the definition of a friend. It's somebody who you dare to be yourself with. Godfather, role model. Uh, he's actually uh, just like Meta, except instead of being beautiful and elegant, <laughs> he's ruggedly handsome and gallant. And then I got my two sons over here, the big guys, you know. So, both my brothers, uh, occasionally my role models, uh, Steve, uh, spacecraft design engineer for NASA. He was the engineer I never could be. I can't tell you how proud I am. And Carter, who just graduated from Purdue in August, is now an actor in Hollywood. Now, he doesn't have a part yet. <laughs> but in the Croc family, that never stopped anybody. Okay? And I said, now, if you can't become an actor, then you should, like, write movies or write plays. So anyway, before I got up here, Carter gave me uh, some lines to read, so I'm going to read them to you. As loyal alums... Carter and I are deeply touched and honored to have our name on this great leadership center. We thank you. Just the best. Just the best. And then, of course, the crazy twins. They've been to Purdue 11 times, even though they just turned three. They were grand marshals in the homecoming parade yesterday. I mean, these guys bleed, you know, black and gold. You already had a chance to see them. They're, you know, I mean... Emma's just like you, but it's incredible. Uh, you know, they, they are brainwashed. They're coming to Purdue. Now we just have to work on make sure they can get into Purdue. But uh, just follow the lead of Carter. Um, and I also uh, want to uh, thank my sisters, Di Di and Terry, who uh, I couldn't ask for better sisters. Boy, you talk about standing by your side through thick and thin. I love you. Uh, it's, it, you just mean more to me than anything else. Uh, all the crazy stuff growing up together. And then, of course, there's Mama Croc. Now, Mama Croc, she's like the Barbara Bush of the Croc family. There's good child abuse and bad child abuse. She's good child abuse. Uh, she's been my role model in many ways. And, you know, I remember playing football in high school. We'd be in the huddle, and you could hear my mom from the from the stands going, Keith, kill him! <laughs> role model of leadership, but also, more importantly, a role model of philanthropy and what you have done for the uh, Children's Oncology Center at the Cleveland Clinic for the last 50 years has been the greatest role model ever. And, of course, uh, also adopted in the family is Murray, man. My mom adopted him, great friend. He's an honorary Boilermaker, even though he went to uh, Michigan. I'm amazed he's here this morning because he just got in from the 
bars over here. But <laughs> anyway. <laughs> and then, you know, all, all, all the great fa uh, family from, um, from Meta's side of the family, you know, starting with Papa Bear over there, my brothers, my sisters, my nieces, my nephews, uh, and Cormac, who's at the big uh, leadership center in the sky. I love you guys. Um, and then, of course, the great trustees, which was an unbelievable privilege in my life to be able to serve with what I consider the best, pound for pound, greatest set of trustees on the planet. Um, and and uh, Tom, I couldn't have asked for a better vice chairman, man. You were this is great. the greatest chairman. I just can't thank you enough. And Berghoff, my, my Marlin fishing buddy, who is chair of the search committee, which I think uh, was our biggest accomplishment as this great trustee team, was to bring in Mitch as the president of Purdue University, which I can tell you, uh, not only myself, but at universities around the world, no, he is. We could the best president of any AAU school. And uh, your code name was Marlin. That's why I said Marlin Fisher. We'll tell you the story later. <laughs>